Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. Today's video, we are going to take a look at two new modules for Titans. And for those of you wondering, you know, when are we going to uh, see these modules uh, for Titans? If I had to guess, probably within the next month, uh, if we are testing these now. Um, as you know, on the live server, this has all been locked. Um, it's going to be eventually unlocked. Um, but before we actually take a look at these modules, I noticed we have uh, Defense, Assault, and Universal. So it looks like three different categories, uh, if you will. Um, when I click on this and I go to the store, I notice there's two different kinds of like armor kits. So we have a uh, Titan armor and plated armor. And based on what I'm seeing here in terms of numbers, uh, it's kind of like armor kit and heavy armor kit uh, basically is what it is. Uh, so we have that. Uh, we have self-fix unit, which is like a repair unit kind of thing uh, that you place on your Titan and it heals it up. And um, just see, we went over to this one here. And we have Diffuser, which is basically like anti-control, uh, reduces the duration of lockdown and suppression effects applied to your Titan. Okay, so those are the uh, modules. Uh, what I'm going to actually do is I'm going to put uh, the self-fix on my uh, Ao Ming here. So we have uh, two of them. And then uh, when I clicked on this one, the Assault, I noticed when I went to the store, we have singular reactor and antimatter reactor. And based on this, uh, it's basically like um, reactor or nuclear reactor and thermonuclear reactor. So that's basically what it is. So it looks like, uh, you know, our Titans are going to have that. Um, let's see, the universal. So this one, I guess I can put, okay, I see what they're doing with this. So basically, I can use reactors or I can use the uh, armor kits on here or the repair. So if you want to do like a double or stack your uh, repair or your self-fix unit, you can place two, which is basically what I've done here. And then we have the uh, repair of the Ao Ming. Um, one other thing too that Pixonic told me uh, before the test server, um, they may have issues with machine guns. Uh, so... What I've actually done was I've removed all machine guns. I'm not sure if they mean it in general, but I did remove it from the Ao Ming as well as the rest of my hangar. So I am running uh, Loki here, Behemoth, uh, Ao Jung, Leech, and the Fenrir. So what I'm going to do, uh, what, I, or what I've actually done here with the Ao Ming, uh, I have the self-fix uh, unit, so the repair. Okay, I'm going to run a game just with this so we can kind of see how it works. And then in the second game, I'm going to uh, run the Arthur, and I'm going to run the other uh, module, which is the Diffuser. So I'm hoping that, you know, someone tries to at least lock me down and I see some sort of effect happen. I'm not sure what's going to happen, but uh, that's pretty much it. So uh, let's hop into a game here and uh, see how uh, this uh, self-fix unit uh, module works. Okay, so we have just dropped in on Carrier Map. And uh, this is TDM. I just kept on getting TDM, so I'm going to play this. Uh, this map actually isn't so bad. And I do believe they've kind of restricted it to be 3 vs 3, it looks like. And you know what? This map seems a lot darker. It actually seems better rendered. Is it just my imagination? I don't know. The graphics seem better. This guy must be in a tier, or not a tier, a Fenrir or something here. Let's try to get him. Last stand triggered. Let's just move on over to this side. Um, we gotta watch out for those guys. There we go. Yeah, the graphics actually seems better. Whoa! Was that from our side or their side? I think it was from their side. I've been death marked. Let's actually try to get this guy here. He does have, uh, he has lost Dan. Let's do this. There we go. Oh! Whoa, look at the lighting underneath here. This actually looks a lot better than on the live server. I gotta watch out here. This guy's coming around the corner. He does have lost Dan on that thing. Yeah, let's just do this. I have one second before I can fly out of here. Oh shoot, this guy's right here. 
But he did land, so that's good for me. We got him down to his last stand, and I gotta get the heck out of here. <laughs> Fly! <laughs> what is this guy running? Is that Behemoth? That might be a Behemoth, actually. I just need to reload. There's also a bug, I think, on the test server, because... I was playing a couple of games, and... Um, Basically, I would fly with my Al Jung, and then after a while, after firing, I couldn't fire anymore. Like, it would just stop firing, and I think that might be a bug. Let's get this guy. Let's just wait for this guy to get out of his. You gotta watch out. They got this uh, behemoth here with, uh, <laughs> with those trebs. Let me just fire. I hope we get to the uh, titans. You know what? I can actually use my titans soon. What the heck? <laughs> Loki. Yeah, let's just go into flight here. I can use my titan now. Sweet. Let's do that. So I'm going to sacrifice this here. For a minute there, I almost thought that was a Loki because of the color of his uh, griffin. Yeah, we're gonna sacrifice this. Man, I'm gonna be in this spot forever here. Yeah, I'm gonna let this guy kill me. Actually, you know what? Forget that. It's gonna take too long. Yeah, look at this. I can't fire. What the heck? Ah, there we go. Okay, I'm gonna go fly off the uh, ship here. And uh, basically kill my bot. <laughs> These guys must be thinking, whoa, nice view, whoa, wait, wait a minute. Well, we know what it looks like from below the uh, ship there. Okay, so I'm going to drop in with my uh, Ao Ming here. And let's see what happens. So I'm looking at the left of my screen. I see these icons here. I'm assuming this one here is the healing. Uh, I'm going to let, I'm going to let these guys uh, take a shot at me. And then uh, see if it repairs my Ao Ming. Let's just... Well, let me actuate here. Yep. So is it healing? Okay, so I'm not healing at all, but you can see my health is uh, regenerating. It's not really that much. But you don't want it to be too much, especially on a bot like this. Okay, I'm going to get down here. Yeah, so I'm actually healing now. I'm using my ability. We're going to blast this guy. Actually, wait. Let this guy hit me. So you can see it actually is healing up a bit. Can you see that? And that's without me using my repair. So we know that that's working. Let's see if we can get hit by maybe this guy here. Is he gonna hit me? Oh, he better hit me soon because he's not gonna have much of a bot left here. Nope, he is hitting. Okay, let's drop down. Let's see what happens. If I can try to hide here. Okay, wait. I guess it's hard to tell now. <laughs> we gotta get rid of this guy. He's actually doing way too much damage. He's doing way too much damage to me. Now I'm getting hit by like dragoons and stuff. So wait, let's hide behind this barrier here and let's watch the um let's watch my health. Let's see if it heals up. Okay, so it is healing. We see okay, you see the green? And that's without me using the repair. Okay, so we know it's working. That's good. I'm gonna get smoked here though. But that's okay. We're still winning here, so not really worried about that. A couple of titans. I think they are all testing out the uh, modules too. I'm gonna just sacrifice this. Whoa, whoa, look, <laughs> look at that. Okay, um, let's use the leech. Maybe I can sneak up and get them from the side. And steal a couple of kills. I gotta watch out for this guy. Because he's going to use the uh, stove ability on me. You're going to see that soon. Let's do this. Whoa, that hurt. Yikes. I'm trying to lock. Whoa. 
That's like... Jeez, man, I better get the heck out of here. This guy's gonna... <laughs> one more hit and I'm like toast. You know what's actually kind of funny? I just thought of this now. If you were to be inside this tunnel thing, if these guys... Oh, actually, wait, this guy can hit me. I was thinking you could actually take out, like, the titans because they can't go inside that tunnel there. Um, let's use this Fenrir. Well, these guys have actually, like, evened things up here. Ooh. I don't want to get too close because of his ability. There we go. Yeah, this guy is actually... Trying to lock him. Let's move on over to this side. Let's take out this guy. He's in the air, so I guess that's a good thing for me. I just gotta heal up here and get close. He, he also only has, looks like he only has one of the saw weapons too, so he's hurting pretty bad. Let's do this. My last end has triggered. Whew. Yes! Okay, now we need a heal. Let's try to get this guy. There's a guy below. I can see an arrow there. I think he's underneath. You know, I'm trying to see if I can get... Whoa! This guy, he just death farted. <laughs> yeah, the graphics is definitely better. It's way better. I can. S this is like really clear. Even even the lighting looks really good. I don't like what they've done there with that. Actually, you know what? It reminds me of. Do you guys remember the um, the beta for the Steam? It kind of reminds me like the lighting effect. Because it was pretty dark um, when I played that version. Um, I'm gonna put up my shield, but I don't think that's gonna help much. Well, actually, wait, maybe. Oh, yes, I tried to heal right at the end, but <laughs> I didn't need to. Um, okay, we're gonna use a behemoth next. They only have one more player. And I, it looks like my teammates are gonna finish him off, and I think that might be it. Unless he has a titan or something? No? What is that? Invader? Yep, that's an invader. Okay, so once this game is done, uh, what I'll end up doing is uh, changing the Ao Ming for the Arthur. And I'm gonna run the, uh, the other diffuser module on it and we can see how that works. But if I had to guess, it's probably the same as anti-control. We're gonna see similar effects. But I do like what they've done with the lighting um, of this map. Uh, things actually look a lot crisper. So, um, you know, this is how we did here. We ended up uh, doing a 2.7 uh, with that. And uh, we actually got to see how the uh, Ao Ming was healing. Okay, so what I'm going to do here. Uh, let's go back. Let's go to the hangar. And we are going to... You know what? I'm going to have to change these weapons here because... Actually, wait, let's just do this. I don't want to run um, machine guns because I don't know if that's going to affect because obviously, you know, they told me that there are issues with the machine guns. So probably not a good idea to run that. We're going to run the uh, saw weapon first. Then let's put the uh, rupture on. That's a pity because I wanted to run the machine guns on the Arthur. So we're going to run this. And uh, we are going to hop in the game now. And we're going to see how we do with this. Actually, wait, before I do that, we've got to change these modules here first. So let's try. So we're going to use... You know what? Can we use this and that? Maybe. Let's try. Let's see what happens. Um, this one here we have... Okay, so we have another self-fix. You know what? Let's just do this. Salt. Okay, so we can actually use... We can use healing on here. 
that's actually kind of cool. Okay, so I'm going to use that. And then this one here is going to give my weapons more damage. So if I go to here, you can see here. So let's do that. And we're all set. Okay, so we're going to launch into a game here. And uh, we're going to see how we do with this uh, setup uh, using the diffuser. Okay, so we've dropped in on Yamantau map. Uh, this is domination mode as well. So I'm going to get this beacon over here first. And then I will move to center. Let's just get this beacon quick. Is it changing? It is. Whoa, wait, what the heck? I got hit by someone. Someone back there has like ballista or something. What is that? Probably Trebs. Yeah, I think it might be Trebs. Yep, it is. Let's... Oh, jeez, this guy got hit bad. Shock trains, too. Let's try to get him. We gotta watch out for that Treb guy. And also there has been a bug with, um, I'm not sure if it's just redeemers, but I was firing earlier and then all of a sudden I would just stop firing. I'm just waiting for my ability here, this guy, if I can get him. He has dropped down. I'm gonna go into flight. Ooh, wait, did that, ah, uh, no, he didn't get me. Close. I'm trying to switch my targeting here. There we go. This guy's lost and his triggered. Let's try to get him here. It's just going to phase shift. Got to watch out. There's a guy behind us. A flank. Come on. I can't fire. This is what I mean. Am I hitting him? Yeah, there we go. Um, we gotta go this way. Let's just do this because this guy's gonna hit me here. Where, where is my team? Oh, I just realized it's me versus three guys. Well, this is gonna be interesting. Yeah, this guy's gonna kill me. Actually, you know what? I might be able to get one more shot in on this guy. I'm gonna see how I do against three players. <laughs> Imagine my damage though. And. Double okay, I got him. That guy's gonna get my beacon though. I'm trying to move on over to the side. My goal is gonna be to see if I can beat three players. <laughs> yeah, the details on the map seem a lot better. You take a look at the, the shadows. The shadows look uh, crisper. Okay, let's, uh, let's do this. It's kind of funny, these guys are pushing beacons, but I mean, there's three of them and there's one of me. You would think that they would actually uh, <laughs> try to brawl it out here. But uh, take a look at the, the details here of the shadows. It looks cleaner. Yeah, so I'm going to move on over to this left side here. Um, we can actually drop in with our Titan, um, but I'm not sure if I want to actually do that just yet. Uh, these guys are... <laughs> they're gonna, they're gonna sit back and camp. Let's see how we do. Okay, we're gonna try to get a little bit closer here. Because this is a brawler setup. Do this. Um. Let's try to get this guy down to his last stand. Nope, couldn't get him. Um, you know what? I'm gonna use a Loki because I know these guys. Uh, I'm going to see if I can beat them by beacons. Let's see what this guy does next. Let's 
Let's see if we can get some beacons. Let's see if we can beat them with beacons. See if they're smart enough to ditch their bots. <laughs> Let's do this. Get him down to his last stand. Nope. I'm gonna I'm gonna see if I can get the side beacon. Because this is domination mode. So one guy I think has ditched his bot. You can see on the left side of the screen. So we're gonna get this beacon. I think they both ditched their bots. Yeah, they both ditched it. So we're gonna get this uh, beacon. I'm gonna go to the uh, center. And then uh, let's see if we can try to sneak up and get that beacon, kill that guy, get the other beacon. That might give us three. So that guy has killed his bot. I wonder if he realizes that. Uh... Yeah, so they're all moving in here. This is so funny. There's three of them, there's one of me. Come on, change. It's changing, right? Yep. So I basically forced three guys out of their bots. So I took a, it's like ki me killing three bots, basically. So we're gonna do this. This is such a funny game. Like these guys are actually scrambling. <laughs> There's only one of me and three of them. This is why I like domination and beacon rush because I always try to see if I can uh, use strategy to outsmart my opponents. My adamant skills are gonna kick in, so I'm gonna actually run all the way to the other side. This is so funny. These guys are like, oh man. And the thing is I got pay shift. Yeah, that's not gonna work on me, dude. And I think I might actually have modules expert on this thing, so they might have to kill their bot. Let's see if we can get this beacon. <laughs> this is so funny. Am I gonna get, I'm seriously gonna get, if I beat these guys and there's only one of me and three of them, this is gonna be the funniest thing ever. Come on, come on. We gonna do a four cap on them. We are seriously gonna do a four cap. No, they're getting another beacon. But you know what I can do is, we're gonna get this guy's moving this way. Let's see if we can lock him down. Let's do this. I'm gonna go into the center now. <laughs> These guys are trying, they're trying so hard. I think, do I have, you know what? I might actually have a uh, full hardy on here. Yep, I'm gonna run to this beacon. <laughs> this is so funny. I actually still have my last stand, so technically I could take this guy. He's gonna suppress me though. This is a valiant effort against three guys. Um, there is a guy on this side here that I think... Oh man, it's a Gareth. I just like hammered the dude with <laughs> the rockets. You gotta admit, that's a pretty close uh, game. I think I'm gonna lose this. Uh, we are getting a third beacon here, but there's three guys here. That means if I kill these three, that guy just killed his bot. His uh, last and his. Uh, um... Oh, you know what? I did get locked down, so I'm not sure if that that uh, skill, not skill, but the uh, module is working. These guys, I think, are running to this other side. I'm trying to get to this beacon here. So, oh, it is a use. I think it is working. Look at the left side. You see, you see those uh, icon things. Those indicators are sort of working. It's so funny, these guys are rushing, like they four capping me. I mean, come on, man. There's like three of you and one of me. I think I actually did a pretty good job, but I'm still gonna show this because um, I did see it flashing on the left side there. So I got 10, be <laughs> that's funny, 10 beacons. Actually, yeah, it was one versus one versus three. Man, these guys actually almost lost. I almost used strategy to beat them. Uh, but that's why it's so important you go for beacons. Uh, you got to imagine if it was three of us, we probably would have won. But yeah, I definitely saw that indicator go off uh, with the uh, author. So this um, module here, where is it? This one, the diffuser. Uh, this, uh, this is, I think it shows the indicator. So this here, uh, basically you did see it on the left side. It was flashing, so that did work. Um, I would imagine if I had actually stacked another one 
maybe I wouldn't have been locked down as easily at the end. But uh, that's pretty much it uh, in terms of what we are testing this weekend. Let me know what you guys think of uh, these modules. And also, what do you think of the graphics? It looks like they have upped the graphics of the maps. Uh, definitely looks a lot like the Steam beta I kind of tested a while back. But uh, yeah, let me know, um, you know what you think of that. And that's pretty much it for uh, today's video. So thank you guys for watching. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you did, make sure to give this video a thumbs up. And if you haven't yet subscribed, consider subscribing. Until the next video, I'll catch you guys later. If only I could change it.